My name is Harold Cluster Kepper. I was born in a little town southeast of Greensburg called Milhausen in 1923. I was 11 years old. This was down my home, Milhausen. And I always wanted to play the ukulele. So I never got the ukulele. But my dad sold a load of hogs to the stockyards in Cincinnati. And somewhere coming home in a roadhouse, or what do you call it, uh, they sell different instruments, you know. And, and he brought us home a guitar and a mandolin. And at that time, they called them turtlebacks because they were round in the back. They weren't flat, they were round. And my goodness, they said I was sitting at home. Feet wouldn't touch the floor, but I was trying to play that daggone mandolin. I was having a heck of a time with it. But uh, finally, I must have got it on the table and then I'd pick a note, remember what it sounded like and where I got it from, and I don't know lesson one. I've never had lesson one. So everything that I know, I had to see, listen, remember. go to different uh, dances, wedding dances mainly, because that didn't cost anything to go to the dance, you know. And I always, or I wanted to go, and I wanted to sit up on the stage, or right up by the stage, and watch the guy playing guitar. That's what I thought I wanted to play. And I'd watch him play the guitar. Then I'd try to play it when I get home, and then pretty soon it'd get aggravated, and that went by the wayside. So then I went with the mandolin and uh, played that for some time. I got halfway decent with it. Then uh, how I got going with fiddling, I don't really know. But I saw some fiddlers that was pretty good fiddlers. And I thought, that sounds awful good to me, if I could do that. Dad wouldn't drive at night, but I'd try to go to the wedding dances, and they didn't cost anything, you know, to go in. And if I knew who was playing, then I wanted to go. Well, then I would stand up on the, not on the stage, but right row of benches right in front of the stage and whichever one of them you know guitar player or fiddle player one of those two I was going to watch all the time that's all I did I didn't give a darn about the dancing people if I knew somebody that was playing and they were good players that's where I always went and if there was Oh, I don't know, a church festival or something that gonna be somebody's gonna be out there playing. And I'd walk around and if I found somebody or heard somebody that I thought I liked the way he plays and I liked what he's playing. Now there's where I would hang around. 